Before he got sand in his shoes on Lawrence of Arabia, David Lean had given us stiff upper lips in Burma for the World War II film Bridge on the River Kwai, which we'll visit a little later. But first, more from those other titans of British film, Michael Powell and Emmerich Pressburger. The Red Shoes, starring Maura Shearer, is a tale of romance and artistic obsession, how the worlds of dance and composition can become all-consuming. Central to the film is a 15-minute ballet sequence based on a Hans Christian Andersen story about a pair of magical shoes that allow the wearer to dance spectacularly, but tragically, they don't allow her to stop. Brian Eastdale, a young Mancunian, was given the task of writing the fantasy ballet, and a couple of details are significant. It was the first time an armed Martineau, that early French electronic instrument, had appeared in a British score, and the mighty Thomas Beecham conducted it. Beecham cared not whether his recording actually fitted the film. He just turned up, conducted it, and left the studio. <laughs> but the result was as magical as those red shoes. Eastdale's name was made by this ballet, and when he received the Oscar for it, he was the first British composer ever to win one. Playing the Onde Martineau tonight is a British musician who has performed on countless film scores and indeed is a film composer in her own right, Cynthia Miller. <laughs> 